Welcome to the Wind Up Project. I'm Marla Mogul. I've been collecting wind up toys for over 30 years. My intention is to bring the fun, the joy, and the laughter that I get from these toys with the rest of the world. If you want to have some fun, please subscribe to my channel. Today we're going to be featuring another winter sport, skiing. It's definitely ski season, so I brought out some of my ski wind-up toys. This video is very special to me because my very first wind-up toy was my little ski bunny. This cute ski bunny has, is wearing goggles and is very, very happy. It used to say veil right here across his tummy. But over all these years, it has worn out. I got this wind-up toy, I'm guessing around 1986, at a small toy store in Vail, Colorado. It's been around for a really long time. Unfortunately, it doesn't work any longer. But again, that one is the nearest and dearest to my heart. That toy is made by Tomy. And this one is also made by Tomy. You can really see the resemblance in the two toys. We've got the bunny and we've got the ski bear, and I think this one works. These were actually called Funny Bunny and Funny Bear. Snow Funny Bear actually is still doing a really good job skiing. And the great thing about these is that they may ski a little crazy, but they never fall. This looks very similar to the other two Tomy toys. I believe it's a bird because it does have a beak, but it's a reproduction of a Tomy, or I guess a copy of the Tomy. And you can actually tell in the quality of the poles aren't as sturdy, and it's just not as good of a quality. I don't think it's as well made. Let's see what it does. And the bird doesn't work any longer either. I love this one. This is actually a skiing snowball and it still has Veil vale written on its hat. I believe I got this one at the same toy store in Veil vale that I got my ski bunny. This snowball is wearing a Christmas stocking cap. Unfortunately, it's missing one of the poles, but it still does ski. This one is by Rust Toys. This one has beady eyes that actually move. It looks to me like the skiing snowball is probably on the bunny hill. Does not look real secure uh, with his skiing, which is good that he's being careful. The next toy, this is a very rare toy. It's a collectible from 2002, and this was made for McDonald's. It's Snoopy on skis. It wasn't part of a Happy Meal, though. I got this beautiful kit of all these Snoopy toys. Some of them were wind-ups and they were all doing different sports. And I did open the box and take them out. I kept it empty for so long because I didn't want to open it. But as I've said before, I want to share these with everybody. Let's see what Snoopy does. Snoopy is making beautiful turns. As you can see, his arms actually move up and down as it skis, which is pretty cool. And he's got this great purple stocking hat on, which also has the McDonald's logo right on the front. He's wearing his turtleneck, and he is really ready for the ski season. This Ronald McDonald is from a Happy Meal. This is Ronald McDonald on skis. Very, very cute. He's actually skiing in his regular clothes. And on the back is the McDonald's logo. There's actually McDonald's logos everywhere. There he goes. His body actually moves side to side as he skis. And he skis in circles, which I think is pretty reckless. As long as he's having fun. The next gear is a tin toy. This is actually a reproduction of the J. Chain toy. 
This one is a boy on skis. Back then, I guess they didn't wear goggles, they didn't wear helmets, but he is wearing also a scarf around his neck, which could be dangerous if it's flying up in his face. The interesting thing about this is that he's actually skiing on wooden skis. There he goes, moving both arms <laughs> as he skis. The wooden skis indicate that he was skiing prior to the 70s. That's when they upgraded the skis and they were longer and they were narrower and they were made out of other material, not wood. An interesting fun fact is that wood skis actually date back to 6000 BC from Russia. This is a very similar reproduction of the boy on the wooden skis. Looks like these are not wood skis. What's so cute about this bear is that he's wearing those old bib overall ski suits. Now they're still wearing the one piece suits, but these were pretty funny. <laughs> and his ski poles move up and down. I remember when I was skiing in the 90s, we used to wear those bib overalls too. Just like a lot of things in the 90s that we wore. Looking back, eh, not such a good look. I hope you enjoyed the skiers today, and if you are skiing, I hope you're having a great time. I hope you have great snow, and thank you for being here today. Please subscribe to my channel, and remember, keep smiling. Thank you, Stella.